<laughs> Burger tan. Yes. Sideburns. Yes. Composite airplanes. Right. What else? Uh, the Voyager. What's up, people? Casey Putch here at Genius Garage, and it's time for a new build series called The Voyage of the Hamster. That's the hamster. Who are you? I'm Gene Lynn. I'm also known as the hamster. Uh, yes. How old are you? I'm 14. You just turned 14 now. Uh, Gene got kind of internet famous recently because he built the six wheel Tyrrell inspired go kart. Mm -hmm. And where'd that get shared? Um, the drive, uh, the winding road. There's one other. Auto week. Auto week. In the form of the yeah. one news. Um, so that's pretty cool. And what did you start out doing when you first came to Gina Scratch? I started drawing back there. Yeah, yeah, in the studio. Um, in, yep, in the studio. And what was the name of that car you designed? Uh, it was a two-door front-engine coupe called the Hyperion Valena. Cool. So you started off doing design and drawing, and then you built a cool six-wheel race car go-kart. We drove it today. Yep. And the night just works. That was cool. So who's this guy back here? Who are you? I'm Brock. Yeah, what do you do, Brock? Um, I was a big part of this project right behind us. This is the Jackal, and the um, Southwest Camel biplane. What up? <laughs> yeah, you know, no big deal. Yeah, college students built that in four months. <laughs> anyway, so yes, and you're back. Why are you back? Um, to, you know, inspire other young people and do some great things. Totally. So the voyage of the hamster came from an inspiration. Brock, what was that? The inspiration was uh, actually going out to Kansas and getting a Long EZ, which was built by um, uh, kits that were built... Brock's Brock. <laughs> kits that people could buy back in the day from Burt Rutan, who designed yes. it, who's really cool! Yes. And it was um, also instrumental in designing what? Little Jet Airplane? Brock, what, how long have you been working a day? Uh, too far. <laughs> Sorry. What airplane is said dude in there working on? Uh, the BD-5. <laughs> Poor Brock. Brock, what time do you go to work in the morning? 4 a.m. 4 a.m. What time is it now? 5 p.m. <laughs> so now he, he worked all day, and now he's here to come teach. So, <laughs> Burr Rutan. Yes. Sideburns. Yes. Composite airplanes. Right. What else? Uh, the Voyager. The huge, enormous airplane that weighed less than a thousand pounds without engines, and then o almost 10,000 pounds when it was finally fueled up and ready to go. This plane was huge. It was a 110 foot wingspan. It yeah. was- 28 foot long. 28 foot long. I, this plane was amazing. What did, what did it do? It, what did it do? It flew around the world, not just anywhere, but along the same distance as the equator, which is- Unrefueled. Unrefueled. Never, Never even touched. landed. Mid 1980s, and who flew it? That was, uh, Jenny, Jeannie, Jeannie Yeager. Yeah, and, no relation to Chuck. <laughs> and uh, Dick Rutan. Correct, his brother was a fighter. Really neat. Right. Yeah, they, they didn't even have to turn the plane. They could just fly it straight. They did the biggest inverted loop ever. <laughs> I, I guess yes, you could say that. <laughs> so that was an integral, and it was an amazing feat from people that didn't have major funding way back when. Exactly. And obviously a pinnacle and heroes to the Experimental Aircraft Association and the pioneering of flight uh, both in the past and in the future. Right. And Burt Rutan heads up Scaled Composites with Richard Branson, um, obviously doing really, really serious stuff for the future. So, that's cool. But, and we got this hamster here. What should we do with him? Well, maybe we should make a scale model. I think it should be big. How about a quarter scale? That's, that's pretty big. still really big. That's still the same size as this one. So, what, um, we're not going to build. We need, what should we make the hamster do? Some design. Some, what goes into this and some research to know you know what do we need and what are our first steps to making this airplane totally so here's 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 the thought you guys so for the voyage of the hamster in this build series hamster you're getting an assignment right now homework are you yeah. excited oh yeah what why I'm a loser. no because genius grad is fun say that anyway okay so here's your assignment first of all you got to research Bert Rutan and his history of designing aircraft and what led up to the Voyager that circumnavigated the globe on refuel. And the pilots, which is Dick Rutan, which is Bert's brother, and Jeannie Yeager, okay? Mm -hmm. So you need to go into their life and business, and then those people on how they flew it, and what the flight was like, and all the logistics. But also, we want you to learn about the engineering and the construction techniques and methods that go into composite aircraft, such as the Long Easy in the other room, or building of the Voyager, and going further in that type of composite aircraft construction. Mm -hmm. 
So instead of just a lame book report, we're going to give you the resources at Genius Garage to build the Voyager. A somewhat smaller Voyager, but what should we do? <laughs> what should we do with it? Glider, free flight, test the model, control line. Control Big, line. Biggest control line ever. Wouldn't that be crazy? Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is just another insane build where it's like uh, stress, stress, stress. What do you think of this, hamster? Yeah, it's yeah, cool. Can you do it? We're putting it on the internet now. Yeah. All right, yeah. You have do to it. do it. I'll do it. Yeah. <laughs> I will. You think you can do it? I think with a little bit of help, anyone could. Brock, have you ever done this before? Never. And uh, neither have I. Why do we think we can do this? Who's going to stop us? Well, that's a good point. What lesson do we have? Anyway, guys, it's the thing about Genius Garage, and for all you young people out there, it's the opportunity to learn, to research, to figure it out, also going in a construction method, mm -hmm. and learning how to think, process, think, and consider your resources and what's possible, and implement that hands-on in the real world. So that's what we're going to do with the hamster. First automotive design drawing cars, then a six-wheel go-kart that got internet famous, and building a big flying scale model Voyager with Brock as a mentor. So, should we do it? All right, yeah. Where do we start? I don't know. We got a hot wire to cut foam, that's good. Yeah. Maybe you guys should experiment with that with a little bit today and so he can get an idea of it before we send him home to do even more homework. Sounds like fun. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Please subscribe, comment, and like. Share your support with the hamster for the Voyage of the Hamster. Catch you guys next time. Mm -hmm.